8.45 in the morning and Coach Corso is about to make his big pick. Well, the wake-up call is tough. I'll say that. When the alarm goes off at 4 o'clock, uh, it's rough. But once we get out here, um, we usually feel the energy. I like the Coliseum. I, I love the fact that so many great events have been folded here from the Olympics to, to Super Bowls to playoff games to all the great USC games, the great moments we've seen on the Coliseum coming here. So the, the backdrop always brings back great memories. I'm very curious to see how energized the people are because the backdrop for our show is really a lot more about what the group on campus and their fans feel about that team, feel about that game, as much as it is to see a TV show. So I think for, for USC, you would know better than me. Hopefully, hopefully their campus is fired up and, oh, yeah. and excited. This is a big opportunity without playing a bowl game. This is a big opportunity for USC to try to go out there and have one of those big wins that can really help them spin their program, not only into the rest of this year, but more importantly into next year and uh, help recruiting. So we'll see if the, if the Trojans are ready to take advantage of the opportunity. So me personally, I want to see Robert Woods. <laughs> I don't care who's throwing the ball to him. He's spectacular, no doubt about it. He's a sensational sophomore, and I look forward to watching him go out there and uh, go to work against uh, Stanford's defensive backs. We're coming to see what we everybody paid for, right? You know, with with luck in town, and you know, is he the best? And Monty Kiffin and Lane Kiffin saying he's the best quarterback ever to play. You know, he's going to be the number one pick. Our team's really trying to lose to get this kid. I've been around him before, and I'm just excited to see him a year later. And I'm also excited for Matt because I know, you know, he's been through it. Um, Coach Kiffin has said how he's the poster boy for a team that's had to go through the sanctions and you know, be on probation and everything. And he kind of liked to him to get his due tomorrow as well. <laughs>